240 Tic Tac Toe, the series in which you're mashing up two different things and find a play that has that in common. And today we're joined by Pundit. How you doing, mate? I'm doing very good. Thank you for having me on again. Yeah, not bad. Uh, cast is slowly getting there. He's slowly repairing your arm. Yeah, and, yeah. Just another uh, month. Yeah. You've got the charity match in June, so hopefully you're fit and ready for that. Obviously, I'm your manager. Oh, you'll be, nice. I'll be working be out there, Gaffer. I'll be working out. Yeah. As soon as this gets be. off. Be doing laps. Yeah. No problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that should be good in June. Uh, June the 8th. I might leave the link if I can find it to the tickets if any of you guys want to come. It's in uh, Ilkeston, so not too far away from Derby, of course. So something good to uh, raise some money for charity. So let's go to the first round, Pundit. What would you like to start with? Club Nation Trophy. Ooh, uh, let's start with a trophy and we will go Champions League. Champs winner. Very nice. Did you watch any of the matches the other night? I watched Arsenal by Munich and I watched the highlights of Man City Madrid. Great mm. games, great games. Really enjoyed it. Was was it a penalty for Saka? I thought it wasn't, to be honest. No, I don't think it was. Yeah. Because the way he could have very easily... Do if he tried to dodge that and Neuer takes him out. Yeah. And the other thing is Neuer stays on his feet. I think that's another big... If Neuer goes to ground, he gets the pen. But because Neuer stays up and Saka almost dangles his leg into his, Neuer's leg, I think it's... Yeah, I thought yeah. Neuer like, slowed down a bit as well. Yeah. And so... Arsenal kind of gave away a penalty when... They yeah, took the that, goal kick and then Gabriel picked it yeah, up. Yeah, that one was worse. Crazy game, though. I can't wait for the second leg. Is that next week? Yeah. Uh, I think it will be, yeah. Hopefully. Oh, when this video's so out on the day. Nice. Uh, we'll find out. Uh, I'll go for Arsenal, then, since we spoke about them. And I will go World Cup winner. And I will go abroad. Go Dortmund. Um, I will go Spain, maybe. Maybe we'll go for an Italian club, then. And I'll say... Juventus. You get to start. What would you like? Thank you very much. I will go straight away. I'll go Henri top left. Arsenal Champions League winner. Get the corner done. Yep. Could have worked bottom left as well. Obviously played for Juve. I was, I was going to be mean and take oh, that yeah. away from you. Yeah. I'll go opposite corner. Spain, Juventus. There is probably more, but I can only think of Fernando Loriente, the big striker. I was thinking Morata. That's who I was thinking. He's yeah, that's probably yeah. a much, much more obvious one, Morata, to be fair. Um, all right, let's have a think. Really need to get the middle. The one guy I'm thinking of didn't play in World Cup 2014, so I can't say him. Like, the obvious one. What about Kadira? I mean, Kadira for the middle. But do you want him for Juventus? Uh, middle. Sorry. I, was thinking, I was thinking middle. I was thinking middle. Oh, yeah. Problem is, uh, Sammy Kadira never played for Dortmund, <sighs> Pundit, so that unfortunately does not work. Did he not? <laughs> no. Where have I got... Do Stuck hurt the Berlin. Oh my god. I don't even know where I've just got that from. He did at least win the World Cup. You got half of it, right? Uh, I'll go Champions League winning Juventus. Gotta be careful with this because a lot of them didn't. I'll go for Zidane. Oh, that's what I was going to use for to block you off. Um, Juventus World Cup winner. This should be obvious. I will go with Pogba. Pauly P does work indeed. I'm interested to see what happens to him once uh, his band's finished in like three, four years' time. Yeah. Um, ooh. Let's go for the middle. And he did score the winning goal. It's Mario Goetze. Oh, yeah. What's happened to him? I remember, who was he at? Uh, he's, he's doing quite well now, I think. He's back in, back in form a bit at, uh, I want to say Frankfurt. Yeah, Eintracht Frankfurt. He's Is... been there the last couple of seasons. Right, let's think of this. Um, I'm going to go Spade at Arsenal. So, I will do... Um... Bellerin. Arsenal, Spain, Bellerin. Very nice. Arsenal World Cup winner. We'll just say um, Perma Asaka because it's nice to mention him. Did he play in the final? He did in 2014. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think they subbed him on with like 10 minutes to go in the final or something. Oh, yeah, because they would have had Hummels and Botang. Mm. Uh, yeah. We will go Lewandowski. For that one, because I think the other one's harder, but I might be wrong. Yeah, Lil would have won it with uh, Bayern Munich in 2020, I'm pretty yeah. sure. When he, when he should have got the Ballon d'Or, but got absolutely robbed, because yeah, people were like, yeah. nah, we'll just uh, not give it out this year, because it's COVID. Like, that's a mental reason. Spain Dortmund, then. I'm going to say Mikel Moreno. Ooh. Pretty sure works. No, he played eight, eight games for Mikel Moreno at uh, Borussia Dortmund. Went on Jeez. loan to Thingy. There is a Fullback as well. I think it's like Murray or something. Also another Spaniard at uh, Dortmund. But there's not there's not many, to be fair. Um, yeah. So at least we ended with that one last. Uh, but no points for the first round. Right, into the second round. Uh, my turn to start, and I'll just say the EFL. Uh, I'll 
will go um, managed by Sam Allardyce. Big Sam, we love it. Let's go PSG. Let's go a player with a beard. And I'll end off with... Let's finish off with Roma. You know what? What about England? Should we go England? Sure. That's... Uh, I get to start this time. Big Sam and Roma. There is probably more, but I'm just going to say uh, Nakata. Nakata? I wouldn't have even thought about that. That's a good pick. Yeah. Right. Um, I'll go Eber in the middle for PSG beard. Just take that one straight away. I got Lovely. Very got nice beard. Got to be tactical here. Let's get English Roma. And I'll say Chris Smolin. Nice. Um, beard Roma, I will go De Rossi. It's probably a lot for them, I think. Yeah, a lot of, lot of beards at Roma. Yeah. I love it. Uh, beard in the EFL. Oh, that's a good one for Derby. Beard at the club. We'll go Aaron Cashin. You probably don't know him. Cashin? Who does he play but for? He plays for Derby. Oh. He's got a lovely, lovely beard. Okay, I'll go um, Beckham, PSG. I didn't really want to do an obvious one, but... PSG English, I see. Yes, 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 yeah. yes. To be honest, I think that's the only one. Is there anyone else? Is she in English? Surely it's one other person. Is that actually it? That's all I know, to be honest. So, Big Sam and PSG to block you off. There's a couple, actually. We'll say a Nicholas Anelka. Nice. Could have got JJ Kotcher as well. Yeah. So, Anelka would have been uh, when he was at Bolton, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Big Sam, yeah. Oh. But I'm just thinking Defoe Sutherland with Big Sam. I think he... Was he with Big Sam? Surely he was. I think when they stayed up that time. Yeah, I'll, I'll go Defoe. I'll go Defoe. I'm pretty sure that's right. Jermaine Defoe. It's not the most uh, obvious answer. No. Oh, to be fair, he did. He did. Uh, I forgot about that. He went back to Sunderland when they were in uh, League One. So that does work oh, in deep order. I got so lucky then. Jeez. And you kind of did get lucky because that was before that, it technically wasn't the EFO. It was the, like the second and first division. Before, like, 2004. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, all Premier League, MLS, and then a bit of League One at the end. Uh, I'll just finish off the board. I don't think it really matters. Uh, AFL English, we'll just say Scott Carson. Lovely. So, yeah, another draw. You've, you've, you've done well again. Taking it to the 90th minute. So into the third round, what would you like to start with, Pundit? Um, let's start with Unai Emery. Hmm, I like that. I like Emery. I think he's a good manager. Yeah, doing well with Villa. Yeah. Let's say, let's go Everton. Uh, I'll go with Netherlands, country maybe. Yeah, Netherlands. Go for a FA Cup winner. Okay, that should be all right. Um, and I'll go a bold player. A bold player? Yeah, why not? Send off with, let's try Bayern Munich. You get to start, what would you like? Um, I can only think of one Everton Netherlands player on the top of my head, but it's probably some more obvious ones. But I'm thinking of Skeltenberg, the goalkeeper. Is that right? Yeah, Stecklenburg. That's the one. Steck, yeah, that one. Yeah, I'll let you have it. Um, bit of an interesting position to go first. Um, let's go bold at Bayern Munich. I am Robin. If you can get bolder than that. Yeah. Okay, I will go... FA Cup win on Netherlands. Surely I can get that. That must be easy. You know what? Forget that. I'll just go Van Dyke For the middle? Yeah, yeah, for the middle. Sorry, yeah. FA Cup win on Netherlands. For some reason, I thought you could only know I managing yeah, yeah, yeah. Wijnaldum Ultimate PSG and then FA Cup winner. Um, but yeah, Virgil Van Dyke should should be all good. He has got one FA Cup. Very nice. Year before last. I need to go Dutch at Bayern Munich. And I've already taken Robin away. Um... We will say Roy Mackay because he doesn't get enough, doesn't get enough mentions. Great player. Fair play. Right, I need to block that one off. Oh, this fight's gonna get difficult. No, this should be easy. He's managed Arsenal, Villarreal, Aston Villa. It's got to be someone there. Sevilla. Sevilla. There you go. Oh man, my head's gone. Um, why does this happen every game? <laughs> what uh, happens? It's the pressure. Oh. It's the pressure. Bayern Munich managed by Emery. I don't even know why I said Emery. This is the thing. <laughs> you made it more complicated yeah, than you yeah, needed yeah, to. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, I might have one. And I think you can work it out. Yeah. I'm not going to give up on it. I've got to give it a go. Um, cause I'm, th I'm thinking um, Mustafi, but I don't know 
everywhere is that because I think he played for Valencia. I think unless my knowledge is just wrong. Maybe then, and maybe uh, but I don't know if he's played for Bayern Munich. I'm, I have no idea. I'm just gonna have to go with Mustafi. I can't. I can't think of anyone. Unfortunately, guys, I'm sorry. It's oh. alright. Mustafi unfortunately never played for Bayern Munich. He's only yeah. Schalke in the Bundesliga. Um, oh. I'm hoping mine works. It's a more recent one at Aston Villa. I assume Unai Emery would have managed Philip Coutinho, um, who obviously played for Bayern. Let me have a look. Coutinho, so helpful to know. That was a good guess. Of, yeah. Yeah, yeah, he had a, pretty much a season with Oh, uh, God. Is there any, any others? Emery. Or is that the only one you can think of? That's the only one I can think of. There probably is more because Emery's yeah. been around for so long. Uh, but yeah, we're just finishing the rest of the board quickly. Everton and managed by Unai Emery. Could have had Mustafi. Oh, my God. <laughs> there yeah. he is. Um, and then managed by Emery, FA Cup winner, pretty much any of those long standing Arsenal players yeah. from that club. Uh, I'll just say Urzel for the sake of it. Um, Boulder Everton. Got any Bold Everton players? Um, Bold Everton, let me think. Uh, was Tim Howard bold? I don't even know. He, he had was. a skin. Or did he have a skin head? I don't know. He was bold. I'd say he's bold, yeah. We'll take that. Uh, Lee Carsley as well. And then Bold FA Cup winner. I'll try Yap Stam. He's quite bold. Has he won an FA Cup with Man United? I actually saw him the other day. Was he at the game, was he? He was. Yeah, one FA Cup. Obviously, the treble year, winning year for Man United. Yeah. 29. There you go. Um, but yeah, that was... Other than Coutinho, I can't think of any others. Um, but yeah, let us know if you do know any other Bayern Munich and uh, managed by Unai Emery. Let's get to the next round. Right, into the fourth round. My turn to start. And we will say a little bit of AC Milan. Um, I will go Europe... Euros winner. Premier League team, shall we say. It's one of Euros. That'd be... Uh, let's go West Ham. Okay, I will go... Um, oh, I'm trying to make it a bit different. Um, what about League Cup winner? Carabao Cup, maybe? Yeah. It's not had that before. You ever drink Carabao? No, I don't really drink much, to be honest. Is it nice? It's an energy drink. Um, no, I'm Car not. Oh, I'm thinking of Carly I'm, Cup, sorry. You're thinking... You're thinking of Carling. Oh, that's you're thinking a shocker. <laughs> See, I told you. He said, oh. like, he said, like, I don't drink alcohol. I'm like, yeah, you don't need to be careful. Oh, my anyway. God, mate. Oh, God. Uh, we will end off with a little bit of a... Let's go for a manager. Managed by... I was thinking, ma managed by Nuno Spirito Ooh. Santos. He's at um, Nottingham, isn't he, at the moment? Yeah. He is, but he's been, you know, been about... Um, I will go with France. Nuno and French. I think I've got gonna, one. Yeah, I'm going to go Tangy and Dombele. Yeah, that's, what, that's literally the exact same person I was thinking. I, th I think, I think it, um, he did have Benzema, but I might be wrong. Because I, I remember maybe. when he joined, like, um, when he joined, he was, like, shaking his hand and stuff. But I don't know if he played mm -hmm. any games. West Ham Carabao. Um, there's got to be loads of players for that. Yeah, I'm sure there'll be somebody either left West Ham or... Do I go with Joe Cole? Surely he won it. Surely he won it. Just thinking if there's anyone else more obvious. Yeah, just go with it. Yeah, I'll go Joe Cole then. Joe Cole with Chelsea. Runner-up in 07-08. But he did win it in 04 05, so that Oh my God. Well done. I think... I would have said like Patrice Evra or Zabaleta maybe won it as well. Oh, that's clever. That's clever, yeah. Yeah. Completely forgot about that. I remember Zabaleta. I forgot about Evra even going there. Evra had three, so that definitely works. And then Zabaleta, yeah, what two two with City as well. So yeah, both of yeah. all those work very nicely. Um, I will say Euros winner, managed by Nuno Espirito Santos. Luckily, did manage most of the Portugal squad, and they won it in 2016. So I will say, bit of, I don't think Ruben Neves or Jota would have been in there, but I'm going to say João Martinho. Yeah, that's good. I, I think I would have fallen for Neves then. No, you did good there. Yeah, I think he just missed out Neves because he would have been too young. But yeah, João Martinho, honestly, such an under. I, I can't, I'm kind of annoyed yeah. he's stuck at. Wolves, because I feel like he could have easily played for a bigger team. Yeah, he was good. He was good. In the Premier League. 
yeah, now Braga doing actually quite well with Braga. They they got Champions League this Probably. year. Mm. I think they got knocked out now, but they they weren't qualified for it for the first time in ages. I feel like Wolves sold like a lot of their good players this last couple of years. To be honest. Yeah, they've kind of yeah they've had to. I think because of FFP maybe because they spent so much and then yeah. didn't hit Europe one year. Santos and okay, just thinking of. Uh... Tottenham, when you manage Tottenham, it's got to be somebody who won it there. Well, not at Tottenham, but somewhere else. Oh, this is hard, this one. Unless it's just really obvious, I don't know. Um, I think it might work, hopefully. We'll see. Uh, oh, no. It's not going to work. I was going to say Lingard, but he's not there anymore. <clears throat> Nerd. I'm just going to have to go Carvalho. Sorry, guys. Ricardo Carvalho, I don't think would have been managed by uh, Nuno, to be honest. Unless it's like right at the end. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, right at the end, maybe. I don't know. No, I don't think. No. No, there's no crossover, unfortunately. Um, um, so the player I had uh, would have been Liverpool, and it's Diego Jota. Oh my god. That is so annoying. I was trying to go through the Wolves players as well. I was like, Traore, Jimenez. Yeah. I just couldn't think of that last uh, attacker. That was good. That was good. Yeah. Mm hmm. Uh, there probably is someone in that current Forest team, to be fair. There's just too many to. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, let's just finish in the rest of the board. Um, so, French, West Ham. Uh, got anyone for that? It's going to be loads of people. Zuba. To be Chupayat. Let's put him in there. Uh, French and. AC Milan will say Olivier Giroud. Obviously, West Ham Euros is Emerson Palmieri. Euros winner AC Milan. Oh, um, I'll just say Benucci. Benucci had a little bit of a spell at AC Milan for a season. Yeah, yeah cool. League Cup AC Milan. I don't know if Divock Origi. Yeah, that's a good won. shout. That's a good shout. Maybe he could have been one for managed by Nuno. Oh, my God. The League Cup winner. There we go. He could have, yeah. Divock Origi also does work. I was literally um, onto that. I was literally thinking, like, new players that have just yeah, joined. Current, yeah. It's tricky, though, because there's so many at that current Forest team. What would you like to start with? Um, We will go Liga title. Let's do that. The Liga title. I will say, and I'll go Belgian. Um, I will go. Stinky, could you go Golden Boot? Just for anything, or. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Golden Boot. Yeah, Maybe just in boot. general. Okay. I'll say. Let's go Newcastle. Why not? Um, And I'll go. That's Lossy. Yeah, Carlo. You know, what, I'm gonna say anyone to play in the Turkish league. I'm trying to what think of would like you like to start with? Players. Right, we're going middle. Newcastle Golden Boot. There's got to be someone there. Everyone's played for them. Come on, Golden Boot. Yeah, who anyone? scores a lot of goals for Newcastle? Alan Shearer. There we go. Bang. I'm not even gonna check if Shearer's got a Golden Boot because if he hasn't got a Golden that's Boot, mad. that's yeah. Belgian La Liga title. Edin Hazard. Nice. Didn't really do much, but you want it. It's <laughs> in his cabinet, that's all he yeah. cares about. Who's obvious? Who's obvious? Just thinking, Ancelotti, Belgium. Yeah, that's quite an obvious one. I think you could have probably got Hazard for that as well. I'm going to go Courtois. Ebo Courtois would work, yep. Currently got injured, but uh, would have would have managed him anyway oh. before. Do you remember that cha the Champions League final? What, the game? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was, I've always liked Courtois. He's a very good, solid goalkeeper. Yeah doesn't do it for the set like he doesn't make crazy set it's like he doesn't do saves to the camera he does the save that makes yeah. the most sense to uh, prevent the goal that is class it's class uh la liga title and turkish league then let's go for samuel eto oh right the liga title newcastle oh, i've got someone i think kieran trippier do you know what? That's a great shout. He did Thank win it you. with Atletico Madrid. Because I don't think Michael Owen... I don't know if he did win it with uh, Real Madrid. He might have, but uh, Trippier definitely does yeah. work. Michael Owen has no no title for Madrid, so yeah. Uh, so I need Newcastle managed by Carlo Ancelotti. Have been, I'm sure there'll be... There, there's definitely an answer for this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. don't know if it works. I'm going to gamble on Hatem Ben Arfa at... Uh, PSG at the same time as Carlo Ancelotti. Ben Arthur was there 2016 to 18. I think Carlo Ancelotti would have been at Napoli about then, or even Real Madrid. PSG, yeah, but PSG was way too early for Ben Arthur. Way too early. What, so it doesn't work? No, Ancelotti oh, right, was chance. at PSG 
11 to 13. You got a chance to win it, Thunder. I was, I was just looking at Turkish League answer last year. I was ready to block you off, but. Mm. No one needs to look at this one. Okay, um, Newcastle Ancelotti. Oh, it's gotta be someone. Mm -hmm. It's gotta be someone. Oh, it's gonna annoy me. Mm-hmm. Comments are probably screaming somebody at this point. Yeah. It's not like obvious though. It's not like, oh yeah, it's Hamas Rodriguez, for example, or something like that. It's Yeah. Oh, I might just have to have a guess. Thought of something really. Yeah. Ooh. What was it? You don't think it gets they, they got one? It's no, I think it, I think I've got one that might work. Yeah. I've got somebody that played years at Newcastle and would have started at AC Milan. But I, I know he played for AC Milan early days, maybe when Ancelotti was there. I'm gonna have to take a guess. I have no idea. I'll be honest. Might as well. I'll just have to go. I don't even know if he play, played. I'm just gonna go Tim Krull. I don't even know. I have no idea. Don't know who it is. Sorry, guys. Tim Krull. What a what a cruel way to. Uh... Potentially go out. You stab me in the heart um, there. Look. Uh, cruel. No, I don't think he. No. That's what he would have ever managed him. Um, so the play I'm going to try, because I know he has early AC Milan, is Fabrizio Colaccini. Oh, there's no way I'll get that. Jeez. One appearance in 05 04 for AC Milan with Carlo Ancelotti. So, uh, Colaccini. That's bad. That's bad. How have you got that? It's very. Just, just knowing that uh, you know somebody's played for AC, like just knowing that Newcastle, like yeah, instead yeah. of going Carlo Ancelotti and Newcastle, I went AC Milan, Newcastle, Chelsea, Newcastle. Um, yeah, I was trying to go for all of it. Um, golden boot winner. Like, it could be a golden boot anywhere and played in the Turkish league. I was, th I don't think so. I think I might be wrong. But I was thinking Adabayor. Adabayor. Let's have a look. Let's see, won a golden boot. Even if it's like just for Togo in the Togo League. Yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> I don't think he does, unfortunately. The most goals he scored in a season was 24 in the Premier League season, to be fair, for Arsenal. Yeah, I'll, I'll go Didier Drogba there. I've given you like two of my answers. <laughs> yeah, you have. You have just gifted him. Oh. Uh, Turkish League and managed by Carlo Ancelotti. Uh, what about Ozil, maybe? I mean, he has played in the Turkish League, but I don't think he has ever managed oh, by Ancelotti. Okay. Yeah, I think it uh, misses out. Actually, ooh, would it work? Have a few months. I might let you have hers, actually, depending on the months. When did Ancelotti come in? Because he, he joined oh, quite late. I think... Yeah, yeah, Ancelotti and uh, Ozil does actually work at the bottom right. Because Ozil didn't join until, like, transfer deadline day Arsenal. Yeah, what a side of that was. Jeez. Yeah. So he had it. He had it from like June till September, yeah. managed by Ancelotti. Um, and then Belgian league golden boot winner. I will say. Duh, 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 duh. The problem is like Lukaku didn't get it in Serie A as well, but probably got it in like the Belgian league. Yeah. What other, what other players have I done him? I'll just I'll just try Lukaku and hope he's. Uh, Oh yeah, Nation League top goal scorer. There we go. Nations League coming, Christ. coming in clutch and leave khaki. <laughs> How um, lucky is that? Yeah. What about, um, I was thinking Mertens. But I don't know. Dries Mertens, he's never really scored a lot of goals though. He's more, you know, creative midfielder yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. Maybe with like PSV. Yeah, decent season PSV with 20 goals there. No, I don't think so. But yeah. Let us know if you're doing any uh, other Belgian Golden Boot winners other than uh, Lukaku's Nation League Golden Boot. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's episode. Make sure you check out Pundit, drop him a sub and all that good stuff. Drop a like on the video and we'll catch you all next time.